Hello everybody and welcome back to Mass Effect 3 Legendary Edition where I just botched the intro. Hopefully I didn't leave that in. <laughs> I put in the right one. <laughs> but it's good to see you all again. It has been, a I'm so sorry, I just hit the mic. It has been a while and I look sick as always. So, good like I there. mean, Shepard does, not me. I look, I actually look pretty cool. I'm wearing a pretty neat, like, um... Aloha print style shirt and some shorts, and uh, I look and my slippers. <laughs> so I look pretty good myself. Let's go. Okay, so if you remember, we're on Omega, we're doing Omega stuff. We do have. I have to remind myself. So we have the main quest for Arya. The landing hasn't gone according to plan. We need to go to the bunker that she talked about in front of active video cameras. It's like she doesn't know where all the video cameras are in her own place, and we have to assist the hacker. And find a power inverter. We always gotta find some sort of power inverter daily walk thing. And I believe we talked to everybody that we could. We're going to do I don't care. Uh, I think this was fine for now. Sure. <laughs> the heck if I remember. Reeve, that's right. Now, who is it? Somebody did say, oh, there was the one. That's okay. I can fix it later. There was there was an ability, and I did look at them all. One of them does give you shields back, and I was like, that could be cool. But this would be nice, too. Increase damage protection while the power is in effect. Sure. Let's go ahead and grab that. Why not? And she seems like she's not dying a lot, and she seems like she would rather have a power upgrade, so here you go, Arya. Time to go find your significant uh, friend. What's your history with this gang? Some mutually beneficial dealings and some occasional violence. The Talons weren't even a blip on our radar until the plague in 2185. Your little war against the other gangs left a vacuum. Not my intention. <laughs> she smiled. Not my intention. Their leader, Darius, took advantage of the situation and carved the Talons a bigger piece of the local drug trade. Opportunists? Are we enlisting them because they're good or because we need numbers? Their cannon fodder, we're using them because they're the only game in town. Oh, I oh. I'm so cynical in my old age, but my shepherd, bless her heart, is not as cynical as I am. You're gonna let them know that? Relax, shepherd. This is how it works on Omega. Just let me do the talking and... It's not like... I'm going to change Arya. <gasps> Isn't like Irene the talent leader? To get to them. <gasps> I wanna, I'm making a bet right now. Let's move. Nyreen is the talent leader. These sweeping cinematics. Okay. Also, I am 100%. Why would they leave crates of red sand lying around like this? I was gonna say yeah, yeah, that's more important going on. That's a big Darius, bad drug. Profit is the only thing that matters to him. Anything else? Oh, that's burn. right. Dang it! So Darius, maybe Darius is a fake leader. Oh. Uh. Anyway. I don't know what I was saying. Awesome. We don't see much of Red Sand in the games, but it actually plays a pretty pivotal part in one of the novels. One of the three novels, the only three that I acknowledge in the Mass Effect universe, written by Drew Carption, the original writer, of Ma like the lead writer of Mass Effect One and Two. Uh, anyway, <laughs> I party. One of these air shafts should lead us to Talon territory. I have already. The terminal is active. Thank you, Commander. Ranted on that. I, I hope, yeah, that they. There's all these buttons for me to use. What do you want to do with the? What's over there? Why? Why can't I get over there? I want that stuff. Oh, maybe I gotta go around through this. 
Oh. Okay. There we go. I was like, the lift was stuck, though, obviously. Okay. I feel like it should be up there. And then I'm gonna go around, and it's gonna be hunky dory. What was I saying? And then I got interrupted because my brain. I cannot. Give me that! <laughs> Give me that. Money. Love money. Where's the... Hang on, it is. <gasps> you know what I bet you I was supposed to do? Oh, no, no, wait, no. Why? Let me have it. <laughs> How am I supposed to access this? I was like, maybe I was supposed to blow up. Maybe I was supposed to wait to blow up this the stuff, but I couldn't wait because uh, otherwise the lift wouldn't go up. Is there a way? Listen, I'm not even a sniper, but you you show me a, a pick up a bowl. I want it. Oh, maybe. Oh no, I know. Okay, the lift can go down now to here, probably. Okay. It's okay, I'm good. Figuring it out. Wonder if they uh, they won't, but I, it would be cool if I got a uh, sorry armor to match my gun. Oh wait, no. Is this 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 is a Solarian gun, isn't it? I was like, shoot, I can't tell Arya to press the button. <laughs> that nope, Shepard just pick up the item. Yep. All right. Oh, it was an assault rifle. All right. It probably wasn't worth that effort, but here we are. You're welcome. Oh, today, uh, by the way, they did just announce um, the Baldur's Gate 3 release date has been pushed up by essentially a month. It's coming out August 3rd, uh, which is super dope. I am super excited. I am tempted to, like, take... Oh, a couple days off work for it, but I feel bad. I'm also really freaking broke. So, um, taking, you know, buying a game and then taking time off maybe isn't the greatest of my ideas, but we'll see. But I'm super excited. And they just announced, like, a bunch. They got the Half Orc, which I 100% want to play a Half Orc at some point. They've had the Drow, which I do want to play a Drow really bad. The Dragonborn, I, I really want to play a Dragonborn, but I just see what they look like. Uh, we'll have to see more of what they look like. Um, Halfling would be super fun, honestly, um, but I'm super excited about the Paladin classes and the Druid Spore and the Necromancer uh, Wizard class. I'm just, you guys, and it looks massive and utterly almost overwhelming, and they're like, Here we have like more than three times the all three Star Wars, or not Star Wars, Lord of the Rings movies, dialogue combined, and I was like, that's not necessarily a good thing, but like, it's essentially going to be Dungeons and Dragons, I guess? Like, apparently there's going to be, like, a ton of permutations on how to play. I worry about that, because that tends to mean that the story structure is not going to be as, like, stable. Um, which is kind of what I want, you know, when I play a video game. It's a stable narrative. <laughs> but, um... I have been having the D&D itch, like, really bad for the past, like, two months. And I can't play with... Like, I don't have anybody to play with. <laughs> and so I've just been making characters. And one of them was a, was a druid, like, a spore, circle of spores druid. And another one was an Oathbreaker paladin. Um, and so I am super stoked about that. Because I guess this, this Baldur's Gate 3 is going to fill, you know, that void in my life. Because <laughs> I don't have anybody to play D&D &D with. <laughs> so I can play with myself, I guess. I guess, if I want to say it like that. <laughs> We're almost done. Uh, okay, sorry. Back to this game, not Baldur's Grade 3, which I am still very excited about. Like, I, that's going to be, like, my obsession for the next, like, year, I think. We're almost done scouting this location. The surveillance drones indicate the detention center is on par with the last one we hit, but something feels off with the patrol patterns. Now the display table is spitting out. I recommend another observation room before we try to extract the civilians. What's that about? Is Talon trying to? Power's offline. Wow. Looks like they were using this to observe the detainment centers. 
Oh, they're observing, uh, like, like Talon was using this to observe detainment centers. Okay, so they're trying to help people? She's like, she only cares about profit. I bet you it's Nyreen in charge now. She seems like a nice person. It is so nice to be back at my sister's place with all my super nice games. That tower is the Talon outpost we're heading for. Ooh. Looks like the Talons are giving as good as they get. Ooh! <laughs> it looks so good! Oh my gosh, hang on, I gotta, I gotta play, play with photo mode for a second. All right, then. Any pick up -ables? Oh, I've had like... Understood. Is she, is he talking to me or to... Blah, 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 blah. Aria, because he should be talking to Aria. He was earlier. Oh, I don't know why I'm yawning. I've had like a 16 ounce like chai tea latte thing, which was delicious. And I've had a 16 ounce soda that was had cinnamon in it and it was freaking delicious. Anyway, you guys are like, shut up. <laughs> no, you're not. <laughs> oh, yeah. Uh, well, hang on. Mm. Oh, dear. I know I could use powers, but I'm actually just having so much fun with this shotgun. Dang it. <laughs> when I can aim with it. Nana, come on. Fine. We'll do a ye old fashioned way. You guys down now? No? There's still somebody here? Oh! <laughs> oh my gosh, look at that. Eviscerated. Anyway, I just hope the hacking people. My influence over station systems has just extended by 77%, yeah. Commander. Thank you. Also her, I hope she did I finish that? Only two? Or did I miss No. Oh. Did I miss some? I have them organized by name right now. Oh, okay, I did. I did the two of them. Where's the Omega ones? Whatever. I think I did them. Oh, more more Cerberus dead people. <laughs> oh, hey. I think that was a Turian. Still have me doing stuff. Gotta search all the corners in case there's people in there. Apparently. So. How's it going? <laughs> I'm surprised she hasn't said anything. She was chattier earlier, like, even as we were running around. Thank you for saving. Oh, 
Oh jeez, hang on, is there anything behind me? No. Gosh. There's non server. Oh my gosh, these guys are scary. Ooh. I missed. Oh, okay. Flat damage. Dang it! trying to cancel the shot. What? It bounced off the shoe pylon. Oh jeez. These guys just run right in. Jeez. Scary. No, oh, stop. Oh, no. See, this, uh, the arc is not good. Bad arc. There we go. Look at these guys. Nope, none of you are shenanigans. They just walk out like Torbjorn and throw down a turret. Oh jeez. Did I do that? <laughs> oh my gosh. Hey, you gotta you, you gotta say something. These people just hiding in corners, hoping to be saved. I didn't miss anyone. Did not look through here. There was this that I didn't pick up just in case. This is so cool looking. Oh my gosh. Oh. Uh, where, you, where am I supposed to go? Down here? Okay. Oh yeah. Listen now. Last chance, Sally. Then so on. I want some of your armor. Why am I holding an assault Back rifle again? Back off. I don't think so. Yeah. I've had threats from worse than you. Not her, obviously. Why was I just letting that guy torture that guy? Everybody's doing it pretty slowly. <laughs> See, she's wearing red armor like Talon is. Take care of the wounded and scavenge what you can. I want us out of here ASAP. You heard the boss. Move it. I so knew it. The Talon leader. My. Nyreen, aren't you full of surprises? Arya, the deception was necessary. I needed to figure out what your plans were. The people on Omega depend on us. I couldn't risk compromising our operation. Not exactly standard procedures for a street gang. When Cerberus invaded, the Talons were a mess. I brought new direction. Oh. The general's been hunting us ever since. 
Right now, he's attacking one of our outposts. That's where I need to be. The Talon gig is new. Boss? Right. Arya, Commander Shepard, whatever you're here for, the answer is no. Kindly escort yourselves off Talon territory. We're here to help. We'll talk about it after we reach your outpost. <laughs> That's a generous offer. Arya, does the commander also speak for you? Not the way I would have put it, but that's the idea. All right, then. Come with me. That was easy. That was very easy. <laughs> We're like, no, we want to help. And she was like, okay, that's fine. <laughs> You've improved your biotics since last I saw you. You noticed the biotic grenade? You always did like blowing things up, given half a chance. Oh, does that mean, like, blowing up whatever happened between you two? Is there, there's, like, subtext going on here? Level 48, I think it said. What is it? I think the max level is 50? Let me see. It is 60. Okay. I think it's 60. Some of these look confused. I think back in the day... Um, I don't know. Yeah, okay, the legendary level scaling was 30, and the classic level cap which is, is double. Oh yeah, people asking if you could hit max level in Mass Effect 1, and I'm pretty sure you actually cannot. I did reach it once back in the day on the Xbox 360, I think. Or the old PC version, I don't know, but I did hit it. It's probably the Xbox version, honestly, because I played the most on that. Took, oh, took a game, new game plus, despite having done everything you can do in... Sure. Let's go. We've got time. So the old elevator chit chat that we used to have. Not well not we, but you know, we collective in the game used to have. No? Just gonna be an awkward silence. Love that for us. I love the red and gold look. I think it's very nice. I would love a matching set. Uh oh. Rampart Mex incoming. Oh jeez. I am trying to break. There we go. Oh, that worked. Over for some splash damage. Oh, is that a new gun for me? Oh, uh, me okay. Oh, okay. <laughs> I was like a missile launcher. What could and like right as I was like I was like, what do I need a missile launcher for? Like I almost finished saying it out loud, and then a freaking atlas drops down. That was. That was hilarious. Oh, another one. Do I need another one? I don't think so. I think we're good. Okay. That was uh, brief. Are we really just gonna sit here in silence? What gun am I holding right now? Why am I holding my pistol? Uh oh. Oh, we just turned into a horror game. This way. Oh, an emergency uh, exit. That's good. Oh my gosh. There's parts in this game that get really spooky where you have to use your 
head camera, and I'm, oh, I'm scared. My companions, like my normal companions, would be saying something about this, so it's really weird that they're staying silent. Is this, yeah. Oh, well, okay, that works. Oh my gosh! Are we, are we doing this right? I feel like I'm going in circles. <laughs> I'm so scared. We are just standing over there. Oh my gosh. Catwalk access. Just gotta... I hope you're not afraid of heights. Uh, I'm afraid of dark spaces. Are we the additional Talon forces? Uh, who's target? Okay, I was like, I think Arya is gonna be the target alpha. Actually, Arya, I'm target alpha. No way. You were no. Oh jeez. We have a push. Very slowly for a uh, phantom. Awesome. <laughs> I win the punching war. Ow! <laughs> That worked really well. I would think Arya's target priority. I mean, Talon would be Lockdown good too. Has been compromised so many times it hardly knows up from down anymore. That's true. Nirene to base. I believe Need it. Need an rather. engineer at the catwalk entrance. Door jammed again. Oh, okay. Let me take a moment. That's fine. That's fine. Aria, please. Aria. You're not just using the catwalks as a secret passage to the base, are you? A long drop is the best way to get rid of unwanted guests around here. Oh, I was like, are there people gonna be on there? Ha! <laughs> I love this gun so much. Perfect, perfect. Are those doors open yet? They're working on it. to get to my people. Okay, well, <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and call this one here, but thank you all so much for watching me as we blast our way through the Outer Belly of Omega. Uh, I hope you're enjoying it. I am. <laughs> so, thank you guys again for watching. Uh, and really quick, I want to say thank you to my patrons, to all my patrons, so to Special Rescue Leader, my Sapling Tier patron, thank you so much for your support, and an extra special shout out to 
Adam, my, I'm about to freaking hiccup. I feel like, Adam, my HP to your patron. Thank you so, so much for your support, my friend. I very much appreciate it. It's very kind. And I want to give an extra, extra, extra special shout out to Christopher, my forest tier patron, who's gone above and beyond in his support. And it's just super, super appreciated. And I don't even have the right words for it because for whatever reason, I'm tired. But thank you so, so much for all your commenting and your support. It really does mean a lot. So thank you guys again for watching and I hope to see you in the next one.